Okay, by the time you're seeing this video, this set is most definitely several months old. I'm filming a lot of stuff for this channel in advance, so things that are new to me are not going to be that new to you when you actually see the video. Which will explain why I'm about to say that today we are going to open the brand new set. Oh, it shook the table. Astral Radiance. Yeah, I have genuinely no idea when this channel is actually going live and when all these videos are going to be seen. So at the time that I'm opening this, this set is brand new. Like my pre-order showed up early, so literally I'm filming this the day before the set officially launches. But I got a booster box of the brand new set, Astral Radiance, and I am super excited to open this set. For those of you who don't know, this is the latest expansion set for the Sword and Shield era of Pokemon cards. It is a booster box, which has 36 booster packs in it. Each pack has about uh, 11 cards, and we're hunting down shiny holographic cards of pretty much any kind. And this set's actually pretty exciting for me. Like, it's not got anything so insane in it, like the last set, Brilliant Stars, had all those like six different Charizards and a bunch of Arcane cards, but this set is all about Legends Arceus. This is the Legends Arceus set, if you can't tell. So if you've been getting back into Pokemon or just really enjoying Pokemon through the new Legends Arceus game, you might want to check out this set because this will give you exactly what you want. So like I said, 36 booster packs that we're about to go through one by one and just see what we can get. There's holographics, there's V's, V stars, V maxes, rainbow rares, gold cards. There's this new thing called called a Radiant Pokemon card, which is different than the old Radiant Collection Pokemon cards. It's a whole thing. Oh no, I dropped a pack. Oh dear, oh dear. Let's open that one first then. Okay, so I pulled a pack out and accidentally this one fell to the floor, so I guess this is how we're starting. A lot less gracefully than I anticipated. Now, I will say, I've opened a little bit of this set already, and the pull rate's not bad. Like, ever since Pokemon introduced this Trainer Gallery subset into their sets, uh, the pull rates have been exponentially increasing. So we'll see what we get on this very first one with a darkness energy, a dark tricks. Oh, oh, that's another thing I've noticed is that it's kind of hard to pull the cards <laughs> off to the side smoothly. But we got a drift blim, a grant, Voltorb, Hisuian Voltorb. So this is what I'm talking about. This is the set for Hisuian Pokemon and Legends Arceus fans. So Hisuian Voltorb, Glammeow, Swinub, Chatot, Chatot? How do you say that? Pokemon, Cricketot, that one rhymed. Rufflet, Reverse Holographic, and starting out with a Cleaver Non-Holographic. So this is the very first Pokemon set that has the new Pokemon from Legends Arceus. Cleaver, that's pretty fun. Isn't that pretty fun? That's pretty fun. Say it's fun. So that pack literally leapt out of the box when I was trying to pull this one out and uh, just kind of started us off pretty tame. So let's see what happens in the pack I was actually trying to get out of that box. We got our code on the back and we put one, two, three. Oh, here we go. We got one of those V-Star tokens instead of an energy. So that's our first card is a little V-Star marker for those who play the game, which is not me. I unfortunately still do not know how to play the Pokemon TCG, actually. I've been meaning to learn specifically I want to learn the original way to play through the Game Boy game. <laughs> I want to put myself through that uh, little rigmarole at some point. Cyndaquil, Sweet Honey Reverse Hollow, and oh, Hisuian Overquill. This is a Pokemon I've never seen before. Man, I gotta do research on some of this Pokemon stuff. But we're moving into pack number three with the Origin Form Dialga on the front. We got Palkia and Dialga in this set in Origin Forms. And those come in, oh man, those come in Vs, V Stars, Rainbow Rare V Stars, and Alternate Arts. And the Alternate Arts are insane. But anyway, we are going into a Quilauva. Zizu, I, huh. Zisu, Zizu? Okay, okay. Uh, uh, Shawat, I'll. Man, I gotta learn how to say words. Poochiana, I know how to say that one. Drifloon, wi uh, uh, Wishcat, Wizcash? I can barely read that on the reverse. See that? I can barely read that. And. Leafeon! So we got a few evolutions in this set as non-holographics. We got a Leafeon. I think we got a Glaceon in this set too. So if you like Eevees, you know, there's a couple of things for you in this set as well. But we're not doing too hot so far. We're not showing up with any hollows or better. I've had legitimately bad luck with picking the boxes that I do these videos on. Like, I'm glad to be moving on from uh, <laughs> Brilliant Stars at the time of this filming because good lord, every time I sit down to film an opening of that particular set, it's like my luck goes down the drain and I only have good luck off camera because <laughs> I've probably said this before, but I have pulled every single major card from Brilliant Stars, including the Charizard alt art twice, but none of that has ever been able to happen on camera. <laughs> we got a Temple of Sino Reverse, 
And oh, here we go. Regigigas, our very first holographic. Now I'm on record of not being a huge fan of the Sword and Shield holo style, but I do like this card and a few other cards in this set. This one reminds me of Stormfront, so it's pretty fun. We're going into the next pack, which has the card that I really want, the Typhlosion. I've pulled the V-Star, but I really want the full art, this Hisuian Typhlosion that turns Typhlosion uh, into a psychic type instead of a fire type. That's really cool. Makes it purple. Purple's my favorite color. And full arts are my favorite kind of modern Pokemon card. So I would like one of those, please. Water Energy. Choi. Yan Mega. Oh. Gape Jaw Bog. Togepi. I really like that Togepi card. Combi. That's cute. <laughs> Chitot. I hope I'm saying that name right. Psyduck. Classic. Drifloon. Oh, here we go. There's our first trainer gallery pull of the box. We got Weird Ear. That's a pretty major Pokemon from the game to be represented in this set. And it's a character rare. So while the Pokemon is the focus, you also get their trainer in the background, which is pretty cool. And on the back, ooh, Cleaver V. There we go. We got a double hit pack this time. I'm gonna grab kind of randomly from the box this time and do this Dialga pack. So any of you watching, I hope there are people watching <laughs> because like I said, this video is being made before the channel has even launched. Uh, did you open? Did you open any Astral Radiance? And did you have good luck? Uh, because man, when I film these videos, I have terrible luck. But when I'm not filming these videos, I have pretty solid luck. My thing is that I'm not really hunting the kind of cards that most other people are hunting. A lot of people like to go for the alternate arts because they're like the biggest, fanciest cards in the set with the most like extreme artwork. And I like those cards too, don't get me wrong. There's so much artistry put into them, but for me, whenever a new set comes out, the main thing I'm focused on is what full arts do they have? Like the specific full art V cards. Those are the things that are the most interesting to me. And this set has a Typhlosion, a Jirachi, a Beedrill, a Starmie. There's a lot of really good full arts in here that I'd like to get. We're going into a Yanma. Swine up, but yeah, if you've opened the set, tell me what you got and if you liked it and if I'm uh, sorry. Uh, Nickit, Petalil, Bergmite going into, okay, we got a Lilligant, Hisuian Lilligant, Reverse Rare. <laughs> I forgot what I was saying there for a second. Oh, into a Mill Tank. That's a fun hollow. Decidueye. I didn't know who Decidueye was until <laughs> filming a recent opening. Like, I didn't realize that Decidueye was like the evolution of Rowlet, and I felt extremely stupid <laughs> because, man, that's something I should have known. <laughs> Golduck, Switch Cart, uh, Mantine. Oh man, they got a Mantine card that isn't just Mantine swimming. I feel like every Mantine card looks the same. Hisuian Voltorb, Hisuian Basculin, Glammeow, Poochiena, Choi Reverse Holographic, and Hisuian Avalug. Now that is not a Pokemon I have ever had to say the name of. Pull him from the very back of the box with this uh, Samurai pack. <laughs> Promise one day, one day in the future, I will get better at learning and knowing Pokemon names. But that day is not today. I forget what this one's name is sometimes. We got one, two, three, four to the front. We got Water Energy, Golduck, another childhood favorite of mine. Super effective glasses, Cricketoon, Yanma, lots of bugs, Sudowoto, lots of bugs, more Combi, Ralts, what is Ralts? Okay, Nickit, ooh, Reverse Hollow Quilava, very underrated Pokemon. Not enough love for the middle evolutions, but I think we got something on the back here. Hey, Origin Form Dialga V. I'm more of a Palkia guy myself, and I've not seen any Palkias yet in the stuff that I've opened, so we'll see if that can show up, but this is a great Dialga. Look at the shine on that, man. So we're doing all right so far, but we have yet to get any of those like super crazy rares with the texture on them. I call them texture rares, even though that is definitely not their actual name, but we'll see what we can get. I think they're just generally called full arts, but the full art is a type of card, I don't know. Uh, but we'll see if we can get anything like that as we move move into Magneton, Spicy Seasoned Curry. Oh, wow, <laughs> Suian Electrode. Okay, that is grass. I thought that was a city. I thought that was a city and he was huge. Never mind. Sudowoodo, I always like that Pokemon. Magnemite, Ralts, that's a great art. I was m making jokes last time about not knowing what Ralts is, but that is beautiful art. Look at that. Moving into a Hisuian Sneasel, and then Mischievous. Wait and see Turbo into, whoa, <laughs> oh, oh, how appropriate he showed up. 
he showed up the origin form Palkia V-Star gold card. Oh man, <laughs> I spoke it into existence. I spoke the boy into existence. I think I really just like this one more because because pink, <laughs> really. V-Stars are definitely one of the best new things the Pokemon TCG has had in a while. I say, having only been into it for a year. So, you know, take my word with a grain of salt, I guess. <laughs> Pulling from the back is doing well so far, so let's move into the, appropriately, a Dialga pack and see, no, I said Dialga, it's a Palkia, my bad. <laughs> Code card, wah, off the screen. One, two, three, oh dear, oh dear. Am I doing this wrong? I feel like I'm doing this all wrong. Four to the front, hope I didn't do it wrong. Yeah, Psychic Energy. <laughs> Heavy Ball, Hippowden, Dark Patch, Pontiard. Ooh, Hisuian Growlithe, that's adorable. Moving into Voltorb again, Rufflet. Ooh, pony, wow, look at the sun on that card. Look at the beams of sunlight on that card, man. That is amazing art. That is fantastic art, dude. Oh, going into a switch cart reverse holographic and Hisuian Basculegion to bring us back down to earth a little bit. Typhlosion, turn around. Rip, rip. Gut, gut the cards from the pack. Toss, oh, that flew well across the room. Oopsies, all right. Oh, Metal Energy, Pillow Swine, Hisuian Electrode, Super Effective Glasses, Psyduck, Petalil, yeah, ooh, Stantler, I like this card. This is a cool art of all these Stantler just kind of chilling. Bergmite, Hippopopotototos, Spicy Seasoned Curry, Reverse Holographic, and a Mighty Enna, Mighty Enna non holo Rare. All right, pulling more from the middle of the box this time. Wiggling my fingers around inside the box, and we got a pack. That was the worst way I could have described what I was just doing. Oh <laughs> my god, here's a code card that shuts me up. Foot of four to four to the front. Uh, metal Energy, Spicy Seasoned Curry, Bisharp, Choi, Combi, Ralts, Nicket holding a fruit of some kind in its mouth. I had to take a second to realize what the word for it was. Togepi, Chitot, I hope I'm saying that right still. Petalil and Regirock. We keep going, we keep going. I think we've only pulled one like big textured card so far, like one big full art pull. So we've still probably got a lot to go in this box, man. I think we're on a bit of a, we're on a bit of a lull right now with the non hollows So let's see if we can pick that up. With the Dartrix, uh, Drift Blim, the, I guess that's a hot air balloon Pokemon. Big bear, big bird, small horse, small bird. Small Oshawott, <laughs> Roxanne, reverse holographic. Oh, there we go. And the Hisuian Typhlosion V-Star. Oh man, this is one of my first big duplicates for brilliant, brilliant stars? For uh, Astral Radiance, I'm so sorry. <laughs> this is one of my first big duplicates for Astral Radiance so far. And man, it is the exact duplicate I would have wanted. I think there's a base of seven V-Stars in this set, plus their Rainbow Rare versions and the gold versions. Uh, uh, there's a few gold V-Stars, but not every single one has a V-Star gold. But the great thing, is that I'm actually pulling them. When I was opening Brilliant Stars, it felt like it felt like I could go through box after box after box and not see a single V-Star, which is weird because that was the very first set to ever have V-Stars in English at least. Scyther Reverse, that's great. And on the back, oh, there we go. You probably won't get, uh, you probably won't see that many people this excited over a holographic, but I was really looking forward to getting this Typhlosion, man. Oh, that's cool. Either I'm starting to warm up to the holographics in modern Pokemon sets, or they're putting in the work to make them a little bit better. I don't know. But yeah, man, I really felt like I could just go through pack after pack after box after box of brilliant stars and not pull a single V-Star. And it was just getting draining because all I wanted was to complete that set. So the fact that V-Stars seem to be a little bit more common to come across, and there's a few more of them in the set, just makes it a lot more fulfilling. We got sweet honey. We got, oh, Cranidos. Cranidos? Cran, crani, uh, that one. Yeah, that one. Pillow Swine. Uh, we got a Hoot Hoot. There's a really cool Hoot Hoot character rare in this set. Cricketot. Stantler again, that's a great one. Hisuian Quillfish. Oh, there's a Scyther again. There's two different Scythers in this set. If you haven't noticed, there's two different Scythers. But then we're going into a Dark Tricks reverse holographic, and on the very back, we got a Magnazone holographic. Now this one. 
pops, man. There is a really strong outline on the actual Pokemon that makes it pop from the art so well. That looks great, dude. Wow. It's got kind of a comic book vibe to it. How many packs is that so far? We got two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16. All right, so we're almost halfway through the box. Cool. Let's just grab two packs and go. Okay, we're gonna start with the Dialga one. I had to remember, for some reason, I can't keep Dialga and Palkia's names straight today. So let's see what happens in this one. With the one, two, three, uh, four to the front, flip it over, fire energy, Bronzong. Ah, oh, Dua, that's cute. Yan Mega. Cyndaquil, really love that Pokemon ever since I was a kid. Really cool to see that one coming back in the sets. Growlithe, Bronzor, don't know why I've switched up the way I'm pulling it. I'm, I suck at pulling it this way. Rufflet, Kamado, re uh, burp, Reverse Holographic, and... Oh my God, speaking of V-Stars, being a little bit more easy to pull, here is a Hisuian Decidui V-Star. I've not pulled this one yet, and that is really cool, dude. Oh man, my V-Star collection for Astral Radiance is already looking so good. Man, that makes me really happy. All right, after this pack, we're going to be done with the first half of this box, and this is going really good so far, which also makes me a little worried that the second half might not go anywhere near as well but let's just see where we end up. With we put the four to the front and we got fighting energy. Gardenia's Vigor. Okay, Wish ca Wiz Cash. Wiz Cash? That sounds like a lottery ticket. <laughs> Temple of Sinnoh. Barboach. Scyther, there's that other Scyther art. Here's the Eevee. Look at that little guy, isn't that just cute? And we got the Heracross, surrounded by fireflies apparently. Teddy Ursa? Growlithe reverse, talking about cute Pokemon. This has been a really cute pack. The Teddy Ursa and Growlithe and on the back. Okay, we got a weird ear holographic. Weird ear, 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 weird ear. All right, check this out. We got two, four, six, eight, 10, uh, uh, 12, 14, 16, 18 packs. We got half the box left. And what we're gonna do for the first, let's actually do it for the first nine packs. Let's do a big mega pack. We're gonna do a mega pack here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a nine pack mega pack where we take all of these, I definitely stole this from Max Mofo. But we're gonna take all these packs, we're gonna take the reverse and the rare slot out, put them off to the side, and then go through the rest of the pack so that we can then have a massive mega pack of only reverses and rares to go through. So I'm gonna try and do this kind of quickly so we can get through the like non-exciting part and get straight to the mega pack. So the way it works, we take the code card off as usual. We go one, two, three, four to the front. We take the first two cards that are left on the back and we set them off to the side and then we can and just go through the pack real quick with the lightning and as left and as uh as elf that's a really cool pokemon i've not seen that one before <laughs> we got as elf gardenia's vigor quillfish rowlet quillfish again oshawott and hoodoo and then we just do that for each one of the packs we just open it up take those last two cards off and go through what else we got see what the cool art is but we save those rares and reverses for later i should probably show you what that was <laughs> one two three oh we got the v star marker there so that's kind of easier to track here's our last two put those right there flip it over with the v star to uh i almost called it an energy then i tried to call it a token and I just ended up saying nothing. Bisharp, the Perugly, the Azelf, we got the Mantine, Quillfish, Basculin, Puchiena, and Glammeow. Where did I throw that V-Star marker? Where did it go? Oh, it's right behind me. So it's rip, rip, gut, code, four to front, two to side, flip, and energy, Whiskash, Sweet Honey, Cricketoon, Pawniard, Puchiena, Yanma, Drifloon, and Sudowoodo. Rip, rip, gut, code, four to front, two to side, other cards, Curlia, Canceling Cologne, Shieldun, Cat Chatot, Bronzor, Cricketoot, Sudowoodo, and Combi. Rip, rip, gut, code, four to front, two to side, other cards in the pack with the Cricketot, Psyduck, Petalil, and Stantler. And you know what? I'm actually gonna call it there. I know I said nine, but I'm just gonna put these four packs back and we'll just stick to five because this is taking a little while and it's actually not turning into interesting content to watch. So we're gonna stop it right there at five packs and make this a five pack mega pack. Walking back on my promises already, this is a five pack mega pack. <laughs> there could be non hollows, there could be hollows, there could be reverse hollows, there could be trainer gallery cards, there could be V's, V maxes, V alt arts, all sorts of stuff. We have no idea. Flip it over and get right into it. Starting with a Regirock reverse rare. That's not a bad way to start. 
<laughs> oh man, moving into the Samurai V Star. Okay, man, this box is just pooping out V Stars. Man, I didn't have that one yet. Oh, and then we got the Hoot Oot character rare. That is a brilliantly minimalist card. Oh, that one looks so good. Then behind that, we've got Starmie V, a nice standard Starmie V. Moving into Magneton Reverse Hollow. Then going straight into a Reggie Drago. So that's our non hollow for that pack. Then going into a Reverse Hollow Chatot. Still have no idea if I'm saying that Pokemon's name right. Then into a Caldeo Regular Hollow. That's a cute one. I have no idea who they are or where they came from. They kind of look like a Neopet, but I think it's a really cute card. Then behind that is... Ooh, here we go. We got a Radiant Greninja. So this is our first Radiant Pokemon card of the box. Look at that. So technically this card is a new variant of getting shiny Pokemon. Shiny Pokemon are usually just Pokemon with a different color scheme, but then the card takes it one step further and makes the Pokemon and the rest of the card holographic while the art itself isn't. It's got this really wild diamond pattern too. Man, that looks insane on camera. There's only three in this set. There's a Heatran, a Halucha, and a shiny Greninja. So this is probably Probably the most sought after one of the batch. But that's not the last thing here. We got a Sneasler V and that is the Mega Pack. Wow, we got really lucky with that one. Sometimes you make a Mega Pack and you don't even get a hollow. So now let's move into those four packs that were gonna be part of the Mega Pack, but then I got impatient. <laughs> let's start with the uh, Typhlosion one. Yeah, I could tell. I could tell that that was not turning into very good content if I was gonna do it for nine packs. So yeah, we just cut it short at five and <laughs> <laughs> we, we clearly got plenty from those packs. So we'll go through these a bit more standard, a bit more slow. We got a Fighting Energy, Ursaring, that's a fun Pokemon, Feather Ball, Hippowdon, Bronzor, Rufflet, Hisuian Quillfish, we got a Rowlet, that's a fun starter, another Hisuian Quillfish, doubling up on the Quillfish a lot. We got a Ursaluna Reverse Holographic. I guess that is a new evolution of Ursa Ring that I've not seen before. And then on the back, oh, we got a Mamo Swine Non Holographic. Next pack, man, I am just really enjoying this set. The amount of V Stars, the alternate arts, the full arts, and having something like shiny Pokemon in there with like this new variant on the standard Hollow style. Ah, that's exactly the kind of thing I like. I've said before that my favorite kind of modern Pokemon card is the amazing rares from Vivid Voltage and Shining Fates, but they don't make them anymore. They made nine of them and then they decided no more. And so my next favorite are the full arts, which are basically the next best thing. Man, getting something else that's a little bit akin to Amazing Rares with those Radiant Pokemon, I just love it. Oh man. Bergmite, Hippopotatos, Cyndaquil, Scyther, Growlithe, Mamoswine Reverse Holographic showing up again, and Ursaluna. Wow, that was the exact opposite of the previous pack. What are the odds of that, man? Booster boxes have a lot of packs. Here is the next one. You really appreciate just how many packs come in a booster box when you're sitting down and filming it and creating commentary for it, or at least attempting to. Oh God, I've lost track of the packs. Ooh, we've not seen this one yet. Uxie? 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 Huh. It's a cool Pokemon. I have no idea how to pronounce that name. <laughs> Sorry. Energy Lotto. We got Overquill. Sneasel. Mistrivus. Mistrivius. Mistrivus. Mistrivus. It's Mistrivus. Barboach. Pawniard. Oh, I can already see. We got Eevee and then a Kingdra from the Trainer Gallery. We got another character rare here. I have never pictured Kingdra to be that big. That is. Oh, that's actually kind of scary. I hit the desk. On the back, we got. Oh, Hisuian Overquill again. Wait, what? Hold up. Wait, there's a Hisuian Overquill rare and uncommon? That's weird. There's a rare and an uncommon version of the exact same Pokemon. You know, may maybe maybe that has something to do with the game that I haven't finished playing yet. <laughs> I've not gotten far in Legends Arceus at all. I don't have time. At the time that I'm filming this, I'm actually working on the uh, Amphibia recap for the main channel. And the recaps, man, the cartoon recaps that I do on my channel are usually some of the ones that people like the best, but man, they take the most work out of anything I make. The videos are always longer, they are harder to script, and they involve more animation. They are always worth it. The videos turn out so well, I'm always so proud of how they turn out, but man do they take a lot of work. So I do not have to, ooh, I do not have time to play 
Pokemon Legends Arceus right now, but we got a Milo. We got a Milo full art trainer from the carrot, uh, trainer gallery. I keep trying to say character rare and then meaning to say trainer gallery and I keep tripping myself up. And we got a Thievel on the back, but that is one of the first full art trainers I've pulled out of any brilliant, I keep saying brilliant stars, Astral Radiance. Can't talk today, man, can't talk today. But yeah, by the time this video comes out on the Fofi channel, that Amphibia recap will have been well done and over and out for probably several months. So it's not a big deal. It's just, you know, I'm in the throes of it right now. And man, those videos take so much effort. I hope I did the pack trick right. Yes, fighting energy. Curlia, I swear I've seen this card art before, but I probably haven't. Grant. Togetic, that's a great one. I really love the Togetic holographic from Neo Genesis, so I kind of wish this one was a hollow, but you know, they got Togekiss now. Mistrevis, Barboach, Scyther, Eevee, Heracross. Oh, Hisuian, uh, huh. Hisuian Braviary, reverse rare, and we got a mi oh wow, okay. Huh, Ms. Magius. Ms. Magius? Ms. Magius, huh. That one. All right, what we got here? We got eight packs left, man. Only eight packs left in this booster box. This has been going really well. I always fear that the booster box I grab for the video is gonna end up being one of the more underwhelming ones. And then as soon as I try to open any cards off camera, it's gonna be the best box of all time. So I'm really happy with how this one's turning out. Darkness Energy, Togetic again. That makes me happy. Ursaring, Spicy Seasoned Curry, Hisuian Basculin, Poochiena, Glam Meow, Yanma. Oh, okay. Swainub. <laughs> Bisharp tried to come out early. And Hisuian Braviary. Again. Can the Dialga pack give us good luck? Oh man, I don't even know what we could even be hoping to get in the rest of this box. I feel like we've got everything that we could possibly be getting from a booster box. We got so many V-Stars and junk. But anyway, Lightning Energy, Dark Patch, Magneton, Gape Jaw Bog, Scyther, love that. Eevee, really love that. Heracross, Mantine, a lot of Gen 2s in this uh, pack. Hisuian Quillfish, Gardenia's Vigor, Reverse Holographic, and a Regice. All right, I think we got six packs left. Typhlosion, Samurai, D uh, Palkia, Oh no, Dialga, geez, <laughs> Decidui, and then two more Typhlosions. Which do you think we do first? I like the Typhlosions the best because there's three each. We're gonna sandwich them. Actually, no, that's not the way I wanted to do it. Okay, uh, Typhlosion, and that one, and uh, no, wait, no, hold up. I'm getting confused. This is what I was trying to do. I was trying to alternate, <laughs> but wait, no, I wanna end on his Typhlosion. Gosh dang it, this way. That's all I had to do <laughs> I was need to put one to the bottom. I know how to do math, and that was basically math. Decidui pack. We got six packs left, so let's see if we can pull uh, full art. The one I want is Jirachi or Typhlosion. Let's see if we can get anything like that going here. Oh, we got the V-Star marker, which always makes it easier to do the pack trick. So we got a V-Star token right there at the start with a Perugly, Azelf, Switch Cart, Ralts, Sneasel, Misdrevis, Barboach, Scyther, Mantine Reverse Holographic, going into Glaceon. So we got all the evolutions that are available in this set. But what they're not is a full art Jirachi or full art, what else is there? Typhlosion, Machamp, Beedrill, Starmie. Oh, uh, Orangaroo, uh, Weird Ear. Those are all, they're all so cool. I think, I think that Jirachi is gonna be the one for me. Either Jirachi or Typhlosion. Quillava. Heavy Ball, Hip Howdon, or some kind of beeping noise in my head. Magnemite, Teddy Ursa, Sneasel, Ms. Drevis, Barboach. We're seeing a lot of the same. Oh, okay. Okay. We got a Reggie Steel on the back, but we got a Radiant Halucha in this pack. All right, man. Two Radiants in a box. I've heard of there being one in a box, all the way up to four in a box. So getting the Radiant Halucha and the Greninja in the same box. That's a great one. Don't drop these after nine like you did with Amazing Rares Pokemon and bring Amazing Rares back. Jesus. Now, like I said, there's only three of those Radiant Pokemon in this set. And if you can get up to four in a box, then that means it's probably not impossible to get every single one out of a single box. And that's what I really wanna try and make happen. I've got all of them from the various boxes and packs that I've opened, but I really want the experience of getting all three Radiant Pokemon in the same box. I think that would be really fun. But on this one, we got the Fire Energy, Bisharp, 
Trekking shoes, that's a new one. Uh, Magneton, that's a great background. Ponyta, another great background. Chitot, I keep getting that one. Uh, Bronzor, Rowlet, Oshawott, Ponyard Reverse, and Ursaluna. Back to Typhlosion in that alternating stack that took me way too long to figure out. But yeah, let's see if my favorite of the pack arts brings any better luck. Let's see. We only got a few more packs. This is maybe the, this is the third to last pack. Yeah, the lightning energy, starting with the Magneton again. Gapejaw Bog, Togetic, I love that one. Rowlet, Bronzor, Oshawott, Hoot Hoot, Cricketot, Deancey Reverse Holographic, that's a Reverse Rare again, and, okay, Vespiquin. Huh, Vespiquin, that is the evolution of Combi. Now this is another Pokemon I've never seen before. Interesting, not a Holographic, but interesting. We got one, two packs left, and we're doing them in the order that I had already decided, because it took me way too long to figure out how to make that order work. So, we're going into this last Samurai pack, and then we got one more Typhlosion pack, and then this box is Dead and gone. All right, one, two, three, four. Don't do anything more. Psychic energy, wow, that rhymed. Okay, Kamado, Hippowdon, Noctowl, we haven't seen that one yet. Hippopopo, Tata Tatas, Cyndaquil, Ponyard, Growlithe, too cute. Voltorb, Miltank, we got the reverse hollow now, and Shaman, oh, that's fun. And with that, it's last pack time. It's last pack time with the Typhlosion, the final pack of the first Astral Radiance booster box on the channel. And we'll see what we got. Oh man, all the cards are glomping together. Uh, one, two, three, four to the front, flip it over. We got a Psychic Energy, Jubilife Village, Quilava, Dark Patch, oh, and the Cyndaquil. Oh man, that's a nice, nice little pairing. Quillfish, Growlithe, Bergmite, Rufflet, uh, with a Sweenub reverse, so no no trifecta on the Radiant Pokemon, and then we're ending on, ah, Feeble. But here comes the interesting part, because one of my favorite things to do once a set drops is work out the pull rates. So, in this box, we got a Regigigas Hollow, a Miltank Hollow, a Typhlosion Hollow that I was super jazzed about, Magnazone Hollow, Weird Ear, and Caldeo Hollow. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six Hollows, which is about standard. Then we got Cleaver V, Origin Form Dialga V, Starmie V, and Sneasel V. So only four Vs, which is a little lower than normal. It's kind of on par, but I feel like we usually get at least one or two more. Then we reached the Trainer Gallery, which got us the Kingdra, Weird Ear, Hoot Hoot, and the Milo, as well as the Radiant Halucha and the Radiant Greninja. Then we reached the big texture rare full art cards of the box, which are Hisuian Samurai V-Star, Decidueye V-Star, Typhlosion V-Star, and of course the Origin Form Palkia V-Star. So that is only four Vs, six Hollows, one, two, three, four Trainer Gallery cards, plus the two Radiant cards, and then one, two, three, four full art type cards, four V-Stars. That is a lot of V-Stars from my experience with Brilliant Stars. So that is an insane amount of pulls. Look at all of this. Is that 20 pulls? Is that 20 pulls in one box? For real? So that is the a Astral Radiance booster box. If you wanna see some other booster box openings, there are some videos on the screen that you can go check out, or you can hit the circle in the center to subscribe to the channel. But other than that, this was wild, dude. 20 in one box, holy crap. Anyway. Duh. Goodbye.